You was walking around this party like you don't know what happens when the sun goes down and the moon comes up. The blunts go round, everybody getting drunk all night. You know we put it down, put it down all night. Hey, we gon' fuck around, fuck around. What's all good, night. YouTube? Never need to hear back again once again. And today, people, today we're for episode number 12 of our Pokemon Sun and Moon Let's Play. In the last episode, you guys, we did a quick Tauros Charge re- Run recap of the island, busting open boulders, getting items, collecting Pokemon, doing everything we can here. We visited 10 Carat Hill as well, but we are pretty much done with Mele Mele Island. We've been told to go to the Haoli Marina because I guess the boat is ready for us to go to Akala Island. So if you guys are hyped for today's episode, and of course, if you're proud of that, be nation, make sure you smash the like button down below for us because you already know can't nobody let's play a game like the motherfucking Nappy Nation can. Let's get a quick recap of the squad so far after the first. And we have half a team uh, constructed somewhat. We have Humongous, our Alolan Grimer, holding the poison bar with that poison touch where I can dis disable poison fang, acid spray, and bite. Very poisonous indeed. We have Frankie, our child, our Briom, holding the quick claw because she's not too speedy with Torrent, Encore, Water Gun, Aqua Jet, and Disarming Voice. And last but not least, we have Gabrielle, our Oricorio, with the sharp beak with Pound, Air Cutter, Peck, and Helping Hand. Now, I said the la at the end of the last episode I was going to go and catch a Slowpoke because I don't want to say I'm I'm trying to catch every Pokemon on the island or whatever, but you know, it's, like I said, it's a new game. I just want to play it and experience it and do what you're supposed to do in a Pokemon game, and that's catch Pokemon. Uh, but I realized as I was catching the Slowpoke, well, number one, I encountered a Wingle, and I caught that. I named it Commode immediately. But when I encountered the, when I was thinking about it, I was like, I ran past the grass patches in the city, and I was like, well, there are Pichus and possibly Pikachus and Abbers that we know of for sure over here that I haven't captured yet either, so. There's a short list of Pokemon that I still need to capture, so I wasn't going to worry about it then, because I'm sure they're going to allow us to come back to Melee Melee Island at some point, so maybe after this episode, when I'm done uh, recording, I can come back and just do a spend 30, 40 minutes or so just catching Pokemon, just living the Pokemon training dream. Hey, Professor, are you sure this old thing's really seaworthy? Kakashi, hey now, don't you go calling my boat old. She's not old. Call her a classic, well-seasoned, yeah. I quite like that it has a sense of history. Shut the fuck up. Shut up, she just punches the bag. Shut the fuck up, Cosmo. Hey, Nappy. Wait, no. Hey, Nappy. If you're all done with catching Pokemon and shopping, yeah, you want to head out with us? I'm not done catching Pokemon. Not. Oh, yeah. Time to sail away. Woo. I'm not done catching Pokemon. I want to catch more Pokemon. I'm not ready. I'm not ready. I'm not ready. I'm not ready. This cutscene is dope, but I'm not ready. I'm ready. We are off. Come on, Grandma. Kick it up a notch. If we push the boat much harder than this, we may all end up at the bottom of the ocean. Oh, oh, oh. You're probably just worried about your silly hat flying off. Stupid white girl, I wonder what kind of island Akala is, uh. Seeing all of Alola for myself is half the fun of doing the island challenge. Isn't this just the best, Snappy? <laughs> this nigga lived here his whole life, he ain't never left Mele Mele Island. Nigga, what? Yo, Akala Island looks like it's fucking jumping, my dude. What the fuck? What the fuck? I feel like I'm about to get an information overload. Like so much is about to come spiraling down top of my head. Akala Island. This looks huge. This looks huge. We're going to be here for like 25 episodes, my dude. <laughs> it looks huge. What the fuck? Here, 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 city. Here, here. Okay, calm down. Land ahoy! All right, Akala Island, here I come. Isn't it a bit late to declare land ahoy after you've already arrived on shore? What a stick in the sun to help me. Oh, air nappy, it was funny, right? It was pretty funny, my dude. I'll give it to him. How's dope? What about you, Professor? This land is certainly a hoy, old boy. <laughs> oh, Cosmo, shut the fuck up. Back in the bag. Get back in the fucking bag. 
What? Still haven't managed to find a shirt that goes with your lab coat, hmm, Kakui? Don't talk shit about my boy. Hello? I've told you you're gonna scare off strangers looking like that. Nebby, back into the back. Kakashi, don't sweat it, Lily. Who are they? Why, hello there. Nice to meet you all. I'm Olivia. Mallow? Like Marshmallow? What voice do we give her? There's too many females in this game. I only have, like, two female voices. <laughs> I don't want to give her the Starbucks girl voice, but I don't... Hey, thanks for stopping by. I'm Mallow, one of the captains here. I was on my way to see who was pulling into port and ran into Mallow here while she was out on the delivery. Yep, my trial will be a chance for all the fine ingredients that make up your team to shine. Oh, she's like another Silent. Oh, God. Especially you two. Your Pokemon look ready to cook with gas. And Mallow isn't the only captain here on Akala Island, of course. So, what's the plan, kids? I feel like she's the Kahuna. Kakashi! Yeah, that's up to these kids. It's their island challenge after all. Yes, I suppose. Okay, then. Enjoy your time on the island challenge, kids, along with your Pokemon. I'll be waiting for my chance to face you in battle when the time comes. I'm looking forward to seeing what you've got. Let's go, Mallow. She's the Kahuna. I was going to say, she didn't even mention Lily. The shade would have been so real. So real. So real. Bro, I bet you... Kakui and Olivia... They was get, 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 get. I was getting to me. Let me stop. Kakashi, I'm sure she wanted to come see that you made it here all right. But she'll never admit it to you. Ha. That's Olivia for you. She's a kind kahuna deep down. The fuck did I know? Yeah. There are three trials here on Akala Island. Well, shit. I guess there's gonna be three on this one, three on the next one, and the last one's gonna be like all important and shit. If you two decide you want to take on the trial straight away, head up to Route 4 there and keep on going until you get to Pan what? Paniola Town. Shoots! I know I'm going first! And then straight to the Pokemon Center! I wonder what kind of malasada they make on Akala, eh? Maybe I'll see about some shopping of my own. And I should find out about the ruins for Nebby's sake, too. The ruins? What ruins? You made it to Akala, big boy! That means a whole new island Pokedex! I'll try to keep you up to date on the new Pokemon you uncover, Nebby. So this is Hia Hia City. I can see the sea. This isn't Gen 2. This isn't Gen 2, Rotom. Can we not go back to Melee Melee? Oh, I've made a huge mistake. I've made a huge mistake. We can't go back. At least not yet. I didn't get a slowpoke. I didn't get my slowpoke. I didn't get my abra. I didn't get my Pichu. Shit. Well, it looks like we're back to uh, exploring. My nickname's Electrin. I like having link battles. That's what communication features. All right, whatever. You should consider picking up a fresh water or two from the vending machine. Your Pokemon guzzle it right down. Is the ferry still not operational? We can go back! Bro, that's dope! Never mind, never mind! I did this mission the other day in Festival Plaza, we had to gather 100 people. We haven't visited Festival Plaza yet either. You have a trainer passport and you're photoed everything. This guy looks suspicious. The Alola ferry terminals may look plain, but they're really great too. They're not just for passengers to catch ferries, they even do the maintenance on the ferry boats right there. And they say there are plenty of Pokemon in the sea. That's the second Poli World we've seen. We can actually buy drinks here. Yo, we're moving up in the world. We're moving up in the world. Do you want to get one more? Can we actually buy shit here? Nope. So on each island, are we gonna lock a new drink? I just thought they disable them just for to push the cafes, but oh well. Alola, isn't it funny how Alola is the name of the region here and how they say hello? It's just so fucking hilarious, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe so the Pokemon 
people brought back from Kanto have increased here in Alola? Many trainers who traveled in Kanto and Johto long, long ago came together to form this town, known as Hya Hya City. Meow, meow. You wanna know what kind of item you should give your Pokemon to hold? If you're not sure, Citrus Berry is a safe bet. Why don't you give me a Citrus Berry instead of just talking about it, you ho? You ho? You ho ho ho? You can't change the nickname of Pokemon once you get in a trade. My Magnite's, Magnemite's nickname is Chrome Dome. <laughs> really? They called it Chrome Dome? <sighs> Alright. Lola, I'm the official name raider. Oh shit! So we know where the move leader is and the name raider is too. Your boy is sexy as shit. Yo, who's trying to rub up on me, though? <laughs> Bro, that should have been a Rotom, a Pokey Fine spot right there. That's what it should have been. That's the Tourist Bureau. Oh, shit, she wants to shop some more. Fuck! You're worse than Serena, my dude. You're worse than Serena. Oh, Nappy! <laughs> what's, what, what's, 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 what's good with it? You looking for the ruins? Yes! This little fellow will hardly sit still. I think Nebby might be interested in visiting the ruins of life. Apparently there's a house... The house... Apparently they house the sacred guardian of Akala Island. A creature called Tapu Lele. Oh, I don't like Tapu Lele. It's my least favorite one. I wondered if you'd like to come with us when we go visit the ruins. I mean, little Nebby here seems to like you quite a bit, Nebby. Why not? I'll be at Tide Song Hotel if you decide you want to come. I'm supposed to be meeting someone there. Someone very important to me. Oh, yeah? Damn, that's a big ass hotel. I'll be alright. I can see the building from here after all. Even I shouldn't be able to lose my way, I think. Jesus Christ, it's a big ass building. And you, I'll have you stay in your bag, mister. Back in the bag. Back in the bag! I like how the bag looks like a Pokeball, but she won't put it in the fucking Pokeball. Master Ball, that nigga, he ain't never getting out. He'll have no choice. He ain't never getting out. Deuces, ho. I've heard there's a group of terrible people around who try to steal Pokemon. A group called Team Skull. We need to be careful if we want to escape the notice of such a collection of villains. Isn't that right, Nappy? I've been done known that hoe. You behind. There's a beautiful building to be explored up ahead. So you can't die close here. Please, Spinda. What's up with you, Spindas? Spin, spin, da da. Now, my question, though, is you got purple pants, though. I'm an old man, you better listen to me. Sure. I mean, I look like much now, but when I was a young lad, I was a captain boy. Even now, I feel my pulse beat up whenever I see a trial gore. So listen to this old man's request. Let me send you out on a trial I designed myself. Do you know the beach near Hano Grand Resort on Akala? There's a curious Pokemon that lives there called Puka Muku it is. Go and register in your Pokedex and report back to me to here. If you clear this trial, I have a reward for you. So catch a Puka Muku. That's that one. I still have the shop music. I don't care. That's the best theme in the game so far. I'm not seeing any pink. Flower cargo shorts, sludge cargo shorts. It's like a muck. I don't see any purple. How do you not have purple? Uh, uh, uh. Those are some dope ass shoes, though, to be honest. We can be decked out in sludge wear. Should we do it? Should we go all sludge? Fuck it, let's do it. Let's go all sludge. I like how those shoes are called Order, like Zygarde. I thought we had sludge. Bro, it's actually kind of dope. 
bro sludge is out sludge is out yo we just dropped so much fucking money i can't even afford any decent shoes our shoes don't match our shoes don't match our shoes are fucking disgusting bro we are sludge the fuck out we spent so much money just now we spent so much money just now Jesus fuck we dropped like 30 grand but yo we look dope as shit here sweetie have a sweet for me you can give it to your Pokemon oh shit thank you Pokemon eat a rare candy would be so shocked by its deliciousness they would level up is that how that works they're so shocked by its deliciousness that they level up they just have no choice they're so awestruck they just gotta level up level right, right then and there on the spot Lola is full of blue. Blue skies, blue seas, it's all over. It's my job to take hotel guests Pokemon out for a walk, sir. Alright, let me slide up in here. I, see, I saw that Stoutland. I saw that Stoutland right there. I feel like we're gonna get another request in here. I feel like we are. So before we head to that hotel, I still wanna do a little bit of poking around. A little bit of poking around, exploring the area. Pokemon that are traded between people get experience. You make it through all of Route 4's twists and turns, you reach Paniola Town. That's where Captain Kiawe's house is. When you're collecting berries, sometimes a Pokemon jumps out at you. Captain Kiawe, that's the next one we're looking for. TM for protect. So, we have one mission right now, that's to catch a Puka Muku. Which we are going to do regardless. Regardless, regardless. As I feel like that's this generation's... Oh, shit. Sorry, but my Stalin is a real thorough kind and likes to uncover every last stone. Could you take another route until we have uncovered all the hidden items here? Well, fuck us. So we have no choice but to go this way. Jeez, you fucking stickler. For your attempt or trial, you'll probably want to get ready in Paniola one last time. But where do you get ready for Route 4 so you can make it all the way to Paniola Town? Route 4's not that bad. Oh! <gasps> Ha ha! We didn't mean to surprise you. You must be doing your island challenge. I'm Dexio. My name's Cena, a beautiful name for a beautiful lady. We're here seeing the sights in Alola. It's unique tradition of island challenge. It's pretty fascinating, I've got to say. They're from Kalos! Oh, I've got an idea. You and Dexio should battle. No, bitch. And why should we do that? Though I might as well test my skills. Is that alright with you? Sure. Then I'll let my partners go wild. Yo, if he has the Kalo starters, that'd be dope. Or if he has the Kanto starters, that'd be dope. They're all grown up! Pokemon Trainer Dexio. That's dope! They're all grown up! He's got a Slowpoke. Well, Slowpoke meet Humongous. He's pretty damn big. Check us out, though, boy. Check us out, though, boy. Catch this bite, my dude. Jiminy Cricket. You can't confuse us either, my dude. We're gonna swallow that. Look at that. That was such a... That was a big gulp. A nice big gulp. Yum, yum. Bro, it's Dexio and Cena. Like, like, I knew they were in the game, but it's something else to actually see him. He's got a fucking Espeon. Bro, Mo's gonna flip his fucking lid when he sees that. Where the fuck did you get an Espeon from, bro? That does fit Dexio, though, to be honest. Like, if I had to choose a Mon to have on Dexio's squad, I could see... I could see it being an Espeon. But, you, bro, you got a big Dark-type weakness, my dude. I just want you to know that. You got a pretty hefty Dark-type weakness. Just throwing it out there. You got a big Dark-type weakness. I just bodied your whole squad, my dude. How about that? How about you know? I just realized that we had all white for the first island. Now we got the sludge gear for the second island. Maybe every time we change islands, we'll change clothes. How about that? How about that? How about that? How about that? Sounds like a plan. Sounds like a fucking plan, my dude. Gabrielle's level 15. Alola trainers have a different charm than those in Kalos. Hot damn, bro. Is Cena want to battle next? I'll give her the dick too. On and off the 
fucking Pokemon Battlefield. That's what I would expect from a trainer doing the island challenge. I felt the bond between you and your Pokemon. I feel like I've oh, I feel like I've been able to have a glimpse of the island challenge. Let me hear your Pokemon as thanks. You really haven't. We just had a regular Pokemon battle. It had nothing to do with the island challenge. Nothing at all. You and your Pokemon are the ultimate team, no doubt about it. This battle reminded me of us in the past and the group of five young trainers. I've made up my mind. I'll entrust this important item to you. Bro. The Zygarde Cube. Okay. The item that I just gave you is for collecting the cores and cells of a Pokemon Zygarde. I'll tell you the details another time, so please keep it safe for now. For your island challenge, it might not be a bad idea to go to Route 4 to train your Pokemon. We'll be taking our leave now. Bon voyage. Bro, they're all grown up. That's dope. That's fucking dope. There's a town of Route 4 with nothing, nothing gets you fired up like a new destination. Can you relax, dude? Like, we get it. Route 4, Route 4, Route 4, Route 4. There is one more hotel on Akala Island, sir. I'll leave it up to your exquisite taste to judge which of the two offers the most delight. Me, I prefer the Tide Sun Hotel. I interviewed for a job at the other place and got rejected. Well, shit. They say the traditional dances of Alola are meant to be expressed of thanks. Maybe the poses used for Z powers are the same and meant to express something. Hmm. Uh -huh. But what's in this here hotel? This is where Lily's staying at. Big ass hotel. The ranch next? So I cut through Caniola Town. You trying to lure my attack using charm? Uh huh. The ocean breeze dances over ya ya. Okay, you singing and you you doing the most. You're doing the absolute most. Float whale Pokemon. Wait, wait, what is this? The strange creature was sucked into the Zygar cube. Sina wants to talk to you. I just received a signal from your Zygarde cube. The creature that you just got sucked into the cube. It's the, the girl. It's what we call a Zygarde cell. The Zygarde cube I gave you is like a nest for cells and cores. Your mission is to collect all the cells and cores. We'll get in touch. What? So there's just little cores squiggling around everywhere. Good day and welcome to the Tide Song Hotel. Lily's just chilling here. Is that a Rotom Dex? It shows the details of the Pokemon distribution you zoom on the map, right? Waiting for up to 10 years? Bro? Star. Star me. You got Sveal plants? Oh, Nappy! I'm sorry! I saw some people who looked like those Team Skull Thugs and I got scared. I was trying to avoid them, and I think I ended up missing my meeting. Oh, but don't worry, it's fine. It's the section I wanted to be. Were you going over one of your trials, Nappy? From what I read, I think the nearest what trial site must be one up on Route 4. You know what? If I didn't know any better, I'd think everyone in this fucking town was trying to get rid of me. Trying to get me to go to Route fucking 4. I swear to God. All right, then. Route 4, it fucking is, then. Well, I think, if anything... We're gonna go ahead and wrap up today's episode before we head to Route 4. We've explored a lot of ha ha city. There's still an area that we haven't explored yet. And apparently, wherever this puke and is at is at the next hotel on the island. So, we will venture out on Route 4 in our next episode, our next installment of Pokemon Sun and Moon. We're gonna wrap things up here for now. If you guys enjoyed, and of course, if you're a proud member of the Nappy Nation, make sure you smash the like button down below for us, because you already know your support is greatly appreciated, and you already know nobody can let's play a game like the motherfucking Nappy Nation can. But with that, we're gonna get about. Thank y'all once again for your support, and thank you for checking out the video. We out this bitch. Bye!